Hi guys and welcome to the bonus page for Go Traffic. Now, I've got a huge amount of reseller packs today. Now, everything that you see here is available plus more inside. Now, we've got over 80 reseller packs inside the members area. And as you can see, it just goes on and on and on. It's a huge, huge collection. Now, with these reseller packs, you get sales page you get the thank you delivery page you get the access to the product you get uh, graphics you get banners on some you get ads on some you get lead pages on some there's a whole collection here that you can use start using straight away now this is available to the first 75 buyers only and it is the first 75 once we hit 75 we'll close it down there's no upsell uh, bonuses or anything else. This is all available on the front end. So you don't need to purchase anything else to get this bonus. All you need to do is purchase the front end product. So it's a huge collection, but you must be in the first 75 to get it. So please, if you still see this available here, you know, get it while it's available. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump inside Go Traffic so you can see exactly what it does, how you know this is going to help you get more social media engagement and put things on autopilot as well for you but remember this is for the first 75 people only so thanks for watching watch the rest of the video hi guys and welcome to the dashboard for go traffic now what i'm going to do is i'm going to walk you through what this does how easy it is to set up how easy it is to start integrating your social media and start putting everything on autom automation now the good thing about this it has a lot of content already built in that you can all you know automatically fill your social media sites with so it creates engagement every day so this is the dashboard this is what you see when you first log in now you've got your tutorials here you've got your workspace as projects media posts facebook pages facebook groups twitter linkedin tumblr and reddit these are your integrations what you can add in so you've got your workspace you've got your projects you've got your managing posts you've got 365 projects i'll tell you what that is in a moment integrations image editor and analytics so first when you first come in you need to create a workspace so you can create as many workspaces as you want so if you're doing different projects online if you're promoting different products or different brands you can create those here so we're going to create a workspace i've already created one for the online success model but let's create a test project so we'll call this apps apps project that's a good name for it now you need to uh, set a time zone now obviously this tells the system when to post. So if you want to post on GMT or EST, you need to make sure that is set here. Now, I'm obviously on GMT, so I set that there. Hit save. Okay, so that should be created there. So what I need to do now is I need to create the actions. I need to create view project. And I need to create a project under the workspace of the apps project. So I can just create that. Uh, I'll call that uh, app promo and you could do a little product description there, project description there so you could do promotion for apps hit save and you can see the app promo is created under the apps project now you get this is just like kind of a default one that says so you could just get rid of that if you don't want it so you've got the apps promo under the apps project okay so you can edit there manage your posts under there and everything else as well so i'm going to show you how to set up the post how to integrate and everything else now <coughs> excuse me integrations if you come here this is how you connect up your social media very very simple to do all you need to do is hit connect and it literally connects up so you've got facebook linkedin tumblr and reddit i've connected twitter here Got other integrations such as your SMTP, Uzign, and Pixabay. So that's if you want to pull across images to add in to your social media, you can do it here. Now, obviously, when you connect these, if you see here, I've got Twitter connected under my, under my online success model. But if you want to connect, for example, under the apps project, you, know, you need to switch to that and just click connect. But literally that's all you need to do to connect and it says successfully connected very very simple very easy to do so now let me show you the 365 projects now this is done for you content every single day 
So you could post, obviously this may not be relevant, you know, to something that you are working on, but it's giving your social media a post every day. So if you're not posting, it keeps that engagement, engagement going. So what you can do is you can look at the posts here to see how they look. So you can select where you want that to go to. So if you want that to go to your apps project, you can or online success model. But you can schedule for three, six, five days here. So you can click that, collect, select which workspace you want it to go to. So for example, if I wanted to go to online success model, click there. Tell it the properties that I want it to go to. So if I wanted to go to Twitter, connect Twitter. But again, if I had my pages set up, I could connect my pages, my groups, LinkedIn, Tumblr, Reddit, and just hit save. And it automatically starts posting every day to whatever property you've set it to do. Okay, so very, very easy to do, very simple to use. Now you've got manage posts as well. So here again, you need to make sure that you drop down the project because if you want to work in, for example, the Apps Project or Online Success Model or however many different products you've got there, you need to drop that down there. So create post. So let's just create this as, we'll just call it Apps Promo. Hit save. Wait for that to save a moment. Okay. Now what we can do now, we can start creating the post to add in there. So, right, so you need to add a, a page a title to the post. Now also, you can you have done for you content. So for example, I've got text here. So if you want to done for you, done for you content, just click here, done for you content. You choose your category. So for example, digital marketing, click there. And you can just use that one, or you can click the next one, the next one, etc. So use very simple to do. Enter a title for that. So uh, let's see what this is. But Digimark is, is the most effective way to promote products. So you could call that effective digital marketing. Okay, post type text. Or if you want to text with image, you can do that there. Now we can add a, an image here just by uploading here. And also don't forget, you can use the images from um, Pixabay. You can also have the video, add the video URL, text with video. So you can add your video there as well. You can schedule here, I can save the draft or post now. So if you want to schedule, click here, enter schedule day. So you can do that tomorrow at whatever time. Okay, and then you can just schedule now. So very easy to set up. Now what you can do is you need to work on each single section. So if you are doing Facebook pages, this is your Facebook pages post, Facebook groups, Facebook group post, Twitter. Again, all these have done for you content. So for example, Twitter, done for you content, digital marketing, use that. And again, you can Put different ones in here in here image text with image schedule as well you've got linkedin tumblr and reddit okay so very very simple to use and very easy to use if you've got multiple projects so you want to kind of schedule out lots of different content too now here as well you've got different um shortcuts built in you've got your done for your prompt so you can uh, repost things here you can add a caption we just want to add that just add that in there hashtag so you can create and add in your hashtags again very easy to use now i've shown you integrations you've got image editor so you can start creating images here so let's just show you how that works so you can share, create a campaign for different images. So let's say I'm going to use the apps project. So apps image. Select the category. So let's say um, social networking. Hit save. Okay, and you can see those images start to be pulled up there. So you've got 
basic templates, you've got Facebook templates, you've got Twitter, LinkedIn. Okay, and if you want to use those, you just click there to proceed. Then you can start editing that and change it around, make it look how you want. Okay, you can see it's a quite a nice editor. So if you want to add things in like this, just click on it. And you can add it, uh, change the editor as much as you want, okay? Then you can save it to your campaign, change template as well. Let's just click back here. So then you've got your analytics. So this tells you, you know, what's working for you in what, what workspace. If you want to join to the Jump to the App project, so just jump there. Then you can see Facebook group. Obviously, I'm not posting anything at the moment. And then Twitter, and you can move around those there. So very nice tool to use, very simple to use. Very, very easy to get going. And very easy to create kind of workspaces and projects under one roof and you know schedule out that content for you as well. And the 365 project is is good as well. You can you know have done for you content every single day without kind of touching your social media. Okay, so thanks for watching and remember if you want my bonus, you must be in the first 75 people to purchase through my link. Okay, so thank you for watching and watch out for the next video.